So traditionally, uh, we, we've developed applications as uh, big monoliths. We create a big WAR file or an ear file, and we toss it out to some server somewhere and cross our fingers and hope it works. And uh, that, that's really good until it doesn't. Suddenly, the, the, the application starts getting more traffic. We need to scale it up. And so what do we do? We toss it out on more servers. Um, never mind the fact that uh, developing these, these big monolithic applications requires the developers to know the entire system. And it's, it's really hard to, uh, to bite off pieces of it. You have to sort of understand the whole system to be able to develop for it. Uh, Modern applications, we're going to start building applications that are, are deployed to the cloud based on microservices. Now microservices um, is a term that's been thrown around quite a bit in the past few years, but it simply means breaking your application down into individually deployed modules, individually deployed services uh, that coordinate with each other to produce some application functionality. Um, microservices aren't a free lunch though. Uh, there's, there's challenges that come with building microservices such, you know, because they are going to be a distributed system. Um, there's, there's challenges in configuration, there's challenges in security. Uh, this is, these are the types of challenges that a, the Spring Cloud project aims to, to help you solve in a very Spring Boot oriented way. So if you're familiar with Spring Boot, Spring Boot makes working with Spring applications extremely simple. Spring Cloud does for cloud development, what, in microservice development, what Spring Boot does for Spring. In a very uh, simple manner, you can uh, enable a centralized configuration server for your microservices. You can enable uh, service discovery for those services. You can enable uh, fault tolerance and failover for those services. Enable security for those services. So in this session we're going to talk about uh, what it means to build a cloud-based microservice application taking advantage of the features of Spring, Spring Boot, and of course Spring Cloud.